The slow pace of development in the education sector in Nigeria is impacting negatively on national development. This development, therefore, requires a sole commitment of stakeholders to make it work. Snail movement in the approach to university education in Nigeria save the breach from collapsing is the topic on the table for discussion. Professor of Education Management, Faculty of Education, Lagos State University, Professor Olayiwola Babatunde Muhammad identified corruption, inadequate funding, and lack of investment in technology as some of the problems bedeviling the education sector in Nigeria. He, however, gave recommendations to rescue the sector from total collapse. If policy output is expected on international academic calendar, it will be guaranteed and enabled by the environment, it will be assured and the incentive state face off. Between and government is to be Other speakers are of the opinion that university education should be given autonomy. Some years ago, the allocation to education was about 15 to 16 percent. And at that time, we were yearning for 23 percent. Today, we have 8 percent, 9 percent of the entire budget to education. We need enabling environments. We need conducive environments. We need facilities to be able to compete adequately you know, with other advanced nations. We need to engage in research. A lot of people are making donations to the university. Even their books and everything, they give it to the university for free. But that's exactly what some of those things that we need to do here. We shouldn't say government alone should continue to do all that. It is the hope of many that stakeholders in the tertiary education sector in the country will come up with lasting solutions to the issues hindering the progress of the sector. In Lagos, Amaka O, NTA News.